This is the best friend game. You play it with your best friends, or people you want to be your best friends, or people who aren't your best friends. Those are your options. And so what you're going to do is you're going to give everyone one of these little, little things right here. You've got six of these boards right there. They've got numbers at the top right there, which I believe you use uh, to score. I think that's right. It's been a little while since I've played this. I played with my sister. Uh, she has this game, and it was, it was pretty fun. You do have uh, these little eraser things. These are actually really nice. They're just little pieces of felt, but they work great as erasers. And then, of course, we've got the markers right here that are really nice. But here is a question right here. Number one, these are all numbered as well. Really like pretty thick, decent cards. All the contents here are really quality, which is nice. Uh, what's my mom's first name? So everyone would write that down uh, that's around the table, would write that down. And then if you get it right, you get a point. So you get to mark off that uh, on your card. Let's go find another random one. What's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to me? That's a little bit more difficult. Uh, you know, you might, you might know, but you might not know. What's my favorite movie quote? And you're writing this down on your board as well. So you'll flip your board over. And if anyone has it matching, they get a point. If not, they don't. So really fun, uh, conversations can come out of this. I don't think this is a game you should play competitively, probably. It can turn into that with certain groups, which is okay. Uh, but this is a game that I think would work great just to get to know people, honestly, uh, as an icebreaker, that type of thing as well. Uh, it's not the only thing that it could be used for, but I think it could be used for that as well. These are two-sided as well, which is nice because all of these cards, there's a, a lot of cards, uh, but they are double-sided. So if I pull out the very bottom one, 250. So you have 250 total questions, which is great. Uh, on the back right here, what am I most looking forward to right now? So you get the idea. Tons of questions and things like that. Uh, exciting game. I think it works really well. It's simple and it's so easy just to jump into. You give everyone some contents, um, all the pieces that they need, and then you ask the first question. It's pretty straightforward and basic. People kind of know what they're supposed to do and it works well. Nice size box, uh, appearance and everything looks really, really nice. So this is a great game. This is definitely one that I like to go to. There's a lot of these types and the one reason I might not go to this is because there's others that are like extremely small and just conversation starters. So depending on the feel and like what I'm trying to do, there's even apps, you know, I might just use an app, but there's definitely, definitely times where pulling this out is a really, really fun way to uh, do that kind of thing. So hopefully that gives you a nice little touch and a taste of this bad boy, the best friend game right there. Great for families, great for friends, uh, getting to meet new people even, uh, and get to know them a little bit more. But hopefully it gives you a nice little touch and a taste of what this is, what it does, and why it may or may not be right for you. Thanks.